Hi there, this is Mike from Presto Mike and in this short video, I'm going to show you why I'm really disappointed in Lumina 2018's clone and stamp update to the Windows version. I have my image open here. Select the clone and stamp tool from the tools menu. Wait for the program to load. You will need to click to select a point on the image you want to start cloning. Then just start painting wherever you want to stamp that selection. If you want to select a different point, hold down the ALT key and click in a different area and start painting again. I personally found this to be a very helpful, easy and fast technique. After the stamping, click done. Here comes trouble. The cloning and stamping is completed but the result does not appear in the preview, though it appears in the filter preset menu below. Let's take another example. Same photo, different activity. I'm going to clone the plane this time. Oh, it's the same result again. The preview does not show two planes though the filter preset shows it. Now I try to um, export the image to see if the image, uh, the result of the image will be applied but it's of no use. Luminar is more of a what you see is what you get to. So that's the disappointing stuff. Hope Skylum takes this up soon and fixes it. In my next video, I'll show you how to transform dull and boring images like this one into something fantastic. This has been Mike from Presto Mike. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.